So, after a bunch of rollbacks and bug fixes, Project Bronze Forever is actually pushing out content updates. And I gotta say, the Gen 8 Pokemon update is really good. Hey guys, it's Infrared God, and I'm back with another Brick Bronze video. Today, I'll be talking about the Gen 8 Pokemon update for Project Bronze Forever and how good it is. I think this is the first time I've praised PBF in a while. So, with that out of the way, Let's talk about why I love it so much. Well, the first thing, obviously, is that it finally puts an end to the content drought we've been facing for the past two months? Yeah, two months. Seeing these Pokemon finally get added to the game is really refreshing. We finally get stuff like Dreepy, Impidim, Hatena, Sinisee, and all their evolved forms even though their evolutions didn't work for a short while. But that got fixed. Anyways, this brings a bunch of new Pokemon to competitive battling, just catching and using it for the storyline. And honestly, it gives people a reason to hunt for other Pokemon. There's really not much to do after you complete the storyline besides competitive battle, and I feel like these Pokemon could definitely help out with that. Hatena can evolve and be used for Trick Room setup, Grimmsnarl can be used for Light Screen setup, well, actually Dual Screen setup, and Dragapult, we all know we're gonna be using Choice Specs with this. Now, let's talk about Brick Bronze's future. I also feel like this will put Pokemon Brick Bronze in a better direction. Seeing that we're finally getting Gen 8 Pokemon might have them update the movesets of the other Pokemon, or it might just bring more updates in general. This is definitely good for the game because of all the rollbacks we've been facing and because of all the data we've been losing, and now we're finally getting new stuff. This also probably means that we might be seeing more events in the future, but the only gripe I have is that they're still not getting rid of these free codes. Like, we got a freezer route that wasn't even code locked, so what are they going to do about a, the trade economy? At least the dupe glitches and everything are fixed, so we won't have to worry about arcade exploiters anymore. But I feel like this update as a whole, not only does it solve the content drought we've been facing, but it also pushes PBF in a brighter direction for the future. And I think that's something I wouldn't have been able to say in the past. Thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace. Is what you thought I'd end the video with, but I actually have one more announcement to make. We're finally monetized! Did you see an ad on today's video? Well, that's because my review got accepted. Infrared God is actually making cash now. And I can't thank you guys enough. Y'all are the only reason I'd be able to make it this far. And we're really close to 1,500 subscribers. So let's see if we can hit that by tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. Thank you all so much. And y'all have no idea how grateful I am. Y'all are some of the best fans in the world. And I'd be a fool not to appreciate you guys. Thank you, and I hope you continue supporting my channel. Y'all are the best.